Kodia ho, haramai, welcome to today's five minute maker space. Today we're making a tabletop straw soccer pitch. So, what are we gonna need for this? Not too much, but a little bit of preparation is required because the first thing we need is two cereal boxes that are the same size. So, depends what you have. Depends what size they are, will depend on how big your pitch becomes. So, we've got those. We've got a piece of green, mm, slightly heavyweight uh, paper or cardboard you could use. We need a marker pen. We've got some hot glue, but we also need a glue stick, some things to cut with. We need a ball, it could be a ping pong ball, but we've got this um, cotton wool ball here. We need a straw and some pipe cleaners. Okay, let's take a closer look. The first thing we need to do is to open up our cereal boxes. Now we need, want to do this rather carefully. So just like the way that you would open it at the top, nice and carefully, just open that out. And we'll do the same for this one. Now we want to open them out. We actually now want to join them together. So we want to caref as carefully as we can overlap these flaps. So one over, one under probably works best. They're there, hopefully you can see that. And then we can just slide them together. Now we want to join them together. So you could do that with um, with a glue stick, but we've got some hot glue here, so I'm just gonna use the hot glue. Here we go. Lovely, and just press that down. Hold that for a while, just while it dries. need to make our goals and we're going to do that each in in each of these green parts here so we might just mark that out with a pen make sure your goal is in the center that's probably pretty important so I'm just going to put a small dot here at nine and at the other end here at nine Decide what size you want your goal to be. Three and a half centimetres either side of our mark there. And then decide how wide you want your goal to be. I think we'll make it three centimetres as well. So just draw that goal in. I'm going to cut it out in a moment. So this has ended up being three centimetres by seven centimetres. So three and a half centimetres either side of our middle mark. And three centimetres across. You could make it bigger, or you could make it smaller. Depends how tough you want your game to be. Now we need to cut along three of these lines. This one, this one, and this one. And just make sure that goes through. There we go, and we, then we push that down. So do the same at the other end. Now let's also mark in the centre part. 
Now let's see if we can fold these to make a table. So, fold down this part and fold back this part. The thing we're going to do is we're going to cut along this line here and this line here so we can fold them up. to do now is we need to fold this in on itself. So you could score a line to make that easier to do. So we might do that as well. So scoring a line, we just take our scissors and you may need an adult to help. Just mark a little line down there. You could use your ruler as a guide as well. Or that line and then that just enables things to fold a little bit more easily. All right. enjoyed making our tabletop straw soccer today. Thanks for joining us. Ka kite.